Now I don't make a lot of pies, but my grandma would say conducting a vibration spectrum survey is just that simple. Let's see what she means by that. To get this job started using the Viper 2 analyzer, it all begins with the power button. Yep, turn that box on and feel the power. Now use the arrow keys to select Vibration Spectrum Survey from the main menu and press OK. Now select Start Job and press OK. If you've already loaded eSetups from our website, then the Viper 2 will give you a list of engines and aircraft to choose from. Use the arrow keys to pick the model you'll be working on today and press OK. Name that aircraft. The information you enter on this screen will be used to populate the report at the end of the job. Now choose the position of the engine you're balancing on this particular job and fill out the propeller and engine information as necessary. Skip the propeller section if that doesn't apply to you. Install your vibe sensors, according to the maintenance manual instructions of course, and connect to channel A on the Viper 2. By the way, you can install up to four sensors to measure vibration at the compressor, turbine, and gearbox in a single run. Now start your engines! Select the condition you want to begin with and press OK. The Viper 2 is now collecting data. At this point you can pause, toggle between the spectra or overall charts, or dump the data and restart the collection. When you've reached the power of the day, press OK. Store the data and move to the next condition to repeat the data collection process. Shut the engines down per manual instructions. Now select Manage Jobs and press OK to review the data, create a report, delete, or export to a USB stick. Well, I still don't know whether it's as easy as pie, but it's definitely easy as, well, I can't think of anything else, so we're gonna go with pie. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can find more 2-Minute Tips and other training resources or head over to our website at www.asasystems.com.